Hello, and welcome to Nelly Kutalot, the Foul Fleet. I'm your host, David and Ark, and I don't know anything about this game. So, first of all, although the music is very cool, let's, uh, there we go. I don't mind having it in the background, but dang, anti-seasickness. Only one button. Dyslexic font. I have no idea. I don't even know what that is. Well, I didn't really see a difference. Maybe that's something that happens later. I'm not going to mess with that because I don't know what that means. All right, so let's begin a new adventure with Nelly Kutalot, the Foul Fleet. How's it going? Once in a distant time oh. and place, a great pirate sailed the oceans. Oh, a great Against pirate. the waves of villainy, she alone defended all creatures tiny and adorable. Oh, okay. Led by her spiritual mentor, William Bloodbeard, she fought the malevolent machinations <laughs> nice. of Baron Widebeard, Whoa. who was a wrongan by all accounts. Hmm. And now, we join the fearsome Nelly Kutalot in the midst of a turbulent sea battle. Oh, great. Okay. Avast! I have ye licked, and now I'll send ye to the tumultuous depths. <laughs> Nelly, stop talking to the stamps. Get back to work. <laughs> I'm sick of working on the mail ship undeliverable. What kind of life is this for a fearsome pirate captain? I'm saying. But I suppose I better start cleaning. Okay. Mr. Johnson doesn't like the sorting room left messy. Oh, I can see where the whole seasickness thing might uh, come into play, because the whole screen bounces up and down. Left click on the mop to interact with it. Okay. Ah, the water's all funny, like it's boiling. Okay, how you Captain doing? Captain Bloodbeard! Okay, let's click to talk to him. Nelly Cootalot, you have failed me. Oh. What are you on about? As if I have. Have you forgotten your last quest? Uh, yeah, remind me again. Yeah, remind me again? <laughs> you rescued a flock of spoonbeaks from the clutches of Baron Widebeard. Widebeard. I did? Aye. But you missed a secret message written in pirate Ooh, code. Pirate oh. code. It should have led you to the treasure of the Seven Sea. No way. But you gave the secret to Baron Widebeard. Oh. Okay then. Uh, let's see. What's he up to? What can I do? What's the treasure? Uh, yeah. How about what can I do? What can I do? Begin yonder. Yonder. The Baron was lately in Port Rubicund. Okay. Follow Whitebeard's trail and avert disaster. Uh-huh. And how do you suppose I'm going to go? Oh, okay. Sure. What's, what's the treasure what's of the, the treasure Seventh Sea? What's the treasure of the Seventh Sea? It'd be a priceless treasure the Baron has coveted oh, all his gonna life. going to be... Lost in the wreck of my ship, mm. the sweet Mary. Uh -huh. I should not say more. I'm meant to be haunting a house in New England. <laughs> What's the Baron up to? I know not what he's plotting, but I foresee oh. many innocent birds be perishing. Birds hate perishing! And now my time ends. <laughs> birds Fare hate ye perishing. well. Of course. But... Go, Nelly. You must stop my treacherous brother. Your brother? Wait! I've got to clean. Since when is Baron Whitebeard his brother? That's what I'm saying. Look for a way to Port Rubicon. Right-click to examine Nelly's surroundings. Press the space bar to see what she can interact with. How about a uh, label? Mine. To see what Nelly is carrying, move the cursor to the bottom of the screen. Ooh, a tag for Dolwich. Oh, okay. An envelope. Sorted mail. Let me guess the envelope. I'll take the tag. You're big about collecting tags, aren't you? Okay. Uh, I'm probably going to need a lantern. No. It's not the kind of lantern you carry around. Hey, well, sorry. I didn't know. 
Can you get in the crate? I can't open it more than a crack. Well, that's rude. Too busy to clean. Okay. Uh, sorted mail. Porthole. Wait, what? Island? Here, go to the island. It's too far to swim. Too far. Ooh, and I don't hey. like the look of those terrapins. Oh, I don't like the look of those either. What's a terrapin? I could use this to stab things. Oh, great. <laughs> That's good thinking there, Nelly. How about stabbing things? I say we take some parcel tape. Sticky, sticky. Okay. Sure, a towering power. No letter. way. There are far too many. Oh, come on. Mailbags? I'm not allowed to open them. Well, what good are you? Um, the megaphone. I can't do that. Well, okay. Okay, well, I did island. I did crate. Can I just walk over here? Oh, yes, I can. Okay. Let's go here. Let's go here. Good heavens. Okay, so what else can we look at? Alright, well, alright, so I might as well... I don't want to mess them up. I only just got them sorted. I'm sure you did. All right, let's look at the porthole. I can't do that. Well, then where do you want me to go? I don't want the envelope. It's full of pen nibs or something. Okay. I don't. I don't know where all I can go. Um. Hmm. Well, what about this? Now that I have scissors. I can't open it more than a crack. Okay. How I'd better not. You... You are not helping me. I don't want to mess them up. I only just got them sorted. Yeah, I hear you. Okay, so I guess go this way some more. I don't... I don't know where I can go. Huh. Alright, well, so... A letter opener, parcel tape, tag for Dolwich. Oh, here's a tag for Port Rubicon. What if I put it on this? That's perfect, but it won't stick on the crate by itself. Of course it won't. That's why I have tape. Sometimes she needs to combine items. Use the tag with something that makes it sticky. Well, what on earth could that be? How about tape? There we go. Now the crate's going to Port Rubikind. Okay, now you have to get in the crate. I can't open oh, it oh, more oh, than oh. a crack. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This on this. Let's see what a letter opener can do. Let's see, shall we? <laughs> oh, It worked. Of course. But it twisted up the letter opener pretty badly. Oh, well. Twist it. Okay, so now get in. Whenever I'm going on holiday, I always think I've forgotten something. Well, let's give it a try. <laughs> now I remember. Air holes. I'd better do something. Oh. Well, we This go. might work. And now I wait in a state of constant readiness. <laughs> this game is... Oh, okay. You don't think anybody's going to notice the snoring? <laughs> I have a crate idea. Oh, Okay, I don't know if you heard me or not. I have a crate idea. Oh, meanwhile, back at the ranch. Okay. This old hulk is so dreadfully squalid and damp. And my dress is fraying. I might as well put on a burlap sack. Are you even listening, Whitebeard? No, no, I'm not. Hmm? Yeah, exactly. No, of course, of course, my little trebuchet. Well, I know good what brother's up with the treasure monkey? is just over the horizon. Once it's ours, I will buy you all the burlap sacks you want. <laughs> but. You're right, my Iron Maiden. Fast things fast. El Mono. El Mono? Begin the incantation. Okay, I have a bad feeling about this.
Explain yourself, pirate. What have you done with my consignment of pen nibs? <laughs> um, oh. nothing. There isn't a single pen nib in Port Rubicon, thanks to you. Do you realize what this means? You'll have to use pencils? Huh, I have my pride. Oh, okay. Okay, what is this? Bird's nest. I'd better not disturb the egg. Of course. Tar? If I need some tar, I know where to find it. Okay. The office door? Come out of here, lady. See ya. The Commodore's locked it. Of course. So how about I'm not window? tall enough to get onto the roof. Okay, how about up here? I can't reach it. You can't climb? I can't reach it. Really? I can't reach it. What kind of... okay. Do, do the cabin, the window. How about the cabin? I can't do that. Well, of course you can't. Okay, Commodore. Haha. <laughs> Commodore XLIV. Commodore. All right, newcomer. Oh, I need your name and yes, occupation. Commodore 64. I'm uh, giraffe repair woman. <laughs> no, no. I'm an adventurer. Nelly Kutalot, adventurer. I don't like the sound of that. I could say it again in a Welsh accent. Please don't. Okay. I'm looking for white. I'm looking for Baron Widebeard. Well, now, there was a Baron here. He was one of the runners of the blasted Toff races. Oh. What happened to him? If memory serves, he set sail in the Heartless yesterday. I'd better find out where the Baron is heading and give chase. Hold your horses. Have you taken the King's shilling? I never touched it. You can't prove nothing. I knew you weren't legitimate merchant navy. Unless you've taken the King's shilling, you can't sail from my port. Oh. Okay, can you give me the king's shilling? Can you give me the king's shilling? You, a purloiner of pen nibs? <laughs> no officer would accept a brigand like you in the merchant navy. Oh. We'll see about that. Alright then. Uh, are you in charge? Are you in charge? I am the Commodore. I catalogue everyone and everything that enters or leaves Port Rubicund. Or I would if the dratted pen nibs had arrived. I'm pretty sure they're on the boat. What, yeah, what's all this about pen What's nibs? all this about pen nibs? Port Rubicon is experiencing the worst pen nib shortage these Holy 40 cow. years. That it's utter, crazy. utter chaos. Oh. I hate Evidently. It. Yeah. <laughs> Evidently. What all are right. the tough races? Fine. They're out of my jurisdiction over in that cave. Penniless aristocrats humiliating themselves in public. A vulgar entertainment for the lowest class of person. Sounds right. great. We're on our way. Um, where's the Heartless Bound? Where was the Heartless Bound? Hmm, can't recall. Don't you keep a log? Absolutely. The ledger is in my office. Okay. Can I have a look? Absolutely not. The office is closed because of the pen nib crisis. Oh, the freaking pen nibs. All right, uh, are you sure? Are you sure you can't remember where Whitebeard went? I told you, it's logged in my office. Your office? Which is closed. Yes. All right. I think. We're Goodbye, done. Commodore. Dismissed. Thank you, Commodore sixty-four. Okay, so in the cave. Let's go up here. Ah, here we go. Oh, I guess I can just keep going. All right. Oh, there's the cave. Cave of Wonders. Jack Tar, really. Whoa. Oh, look at that. It's nice to collect things when you walk in on a beach. <laughs> just, I just took the plank. Let me guess, you need tar. Uh, can you give me the king's shilling? Can you give me the king's shilling? No, miss. You need the top dude for that. All right. <laughs> uh, what's the crack? What's the crack with the toff races? Well, I'd stay away from there, miss. The folk in there are lacking in moral fiber. Don't worry about me. I'm chock full of moral fiber. Plus ethical multivitamins. Ah, uh, nice. Alright, who are who you? Who are you and what are you doing here? Jack Tar. And I'm just standing on the beach. Standing on the beach, eh? That's the life. Aye, it is. Yep. Seriously, why are you here? Well, uh, it's a little embarrassing. Uh-huh. 
Come on. That's right. You can tell me. I'm Come a, on. I'm you a can tell me. Stander. A fellow beach stander. Well, have you heard of Maritime Magazine? The nautical periodical? Of course. Nautical periodical. I'm going to be on the cover of the next issue. Well done, mate. I except. 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 Um. Come on. Beachy's dandy. Tell me. <laughs> they want me to do it with my shirt off? And? And? I, I don't have any chest hair. Oh, I can fix that. <laughs> um, sorry, uh, I just remembered something funny that happened when I was... When I was uh, at a codpiece exhibition at the annual review of the Financial Services Regular, the Ministry of Tickling. At the Ministry of Tickling. Huh? Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Remind me, why won't you go shirtless? I know. I no, told no you before. Hair. No chest hair, eh? Okay. Goodbye. I know what to do. Later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go get some tar. Don't forget, you can right click to. Yeah, uh, great. Give me the tar. Good. Quit. If I need some tar, I know where to find it. Oh. So, okay, so right click. What does that do? <laughs> I don't, right clicking doesn't do me any good at all. There's a crow's nest above the crossbar. Yeah, no kidding. The Commodore's locked it. I know she has. Okay, how come, so how come I can't get tar? Oh, look, I know the dude needs tar. That's what's going to draw chest hair on him. All right, fine. Let's go in the cave. Cave of Wonders. Whoa. Let me guess. Oh. What the? And they're off. Um. Yeah. They're... Habanera does it again. Really? Okay. Annie? Annie, are you okay? Who were you back in? Count Habanera, of course. Of course. Who were you back in? Oh, well, just... That French guy snapping at Habanera's heels. You change your answer every time? I shouldn't disturb them. They look mean. Ooh, they look mean. I can't do that. Why can't you? Can't, why can't you do that? I don't think I can mess with it. Oh, sure you can. Junk. Nah, it's all rotten and rusted. Ah, come on. Hatch. I don't want to place a bet. Oh. Man. Gambling is for losers and pension fund managers. What? What a bunch of. Lucky Jack drinks. Lucky Jack. Let's go talk to Lucky Jack. Hey, Lucky Jack, what's up? <laughs> I love the I love the style. This is so cool. This is all right. Uh... What's your story? What's your story? Me? I'm just a two-time loser serving drinks. Three-time loser if you count Lehman Brothers. <laughs> what drinks have you got? Take a look at the shelf. What takes your fancy? Oh my. Crab juice, Houston Slammer, butterscotch, jalapeno. Uh huh. Wheatgrass. What's spider? What's Houston Slammer? What's Houston Slammer? Moonshine from a Texan prison. Uh, Goes down smooth like a lethal injection. Nice. Um. Want to try some? Not really. No. No. Good. All right. So how does this work? How do the tough races work? The cream of disgraced aristocracy puts shoe leather to treadmill in a 24 karat blue blooded steeplechase. Pick a winner, place your bet, no refunds. Okay. When's the next race? When the runners are ready. Of course. Be a pal and check on them, will you? Oh, okay. Through the curtain downstairs. The password is uppercase R, exclamation point, lowercase D, lowercase X, <laughs> five, lowercase P, uppercase F, two, lowercase Z. My mother's maiden name. <laughs> uh, oh, tell me about the Baron, why not? Tell me about Baron Whitebeard. 
Whitebeard? That guy sure was a runner. I'll wager you never saw the like. Yeah. I didn't think Whitebeard was the athletic type. What he lacked in physique, he made up for in hustle. Gumption. Moxie. But he ran out. <laughs> of old-timey yeah, words? Literally, he ran nah, out. Nah, he hit the jackpot. Then, Splitsville. Yeah, kid. Yeah, see? All right. He hit the jackpot. He had odds of one to one. He'd never lost a race. Then, one day, bam, he comes in last. But his wife placed a bet against him. She cleaned up and they both cleared out. Oh. Wow. Nice of her to clean up, though. <sighs> it's very punny. Very punny. He's gone to He's gone to Splitsville. I mean, he hopped the coal train out of here. <laughs> I thought he left by boat. I mean, he's gone. Uh, okay. We're out of here. Stay lucky, Lucky. Alright, let's check with the doorman. Oh, I probably should check the drinks. Eh, that's okay. What's the password? Yeah, this one. R, exclamation mark, lowercase d, lowercase x, 5, lowercase p, f, 2, lowercase z. Come in. I should have picked something else. Why? I, why, I should have picked something else. Ah. Oh my. Oh, is that a ribbon? I want a ribbon. That's pretty. We're going to need that. What straw sack? I don't think that will work. Well, why not? Alright, let's see what we got. Habanera. Woe be gone. <laughs> hey, go away. What do I need to wash? Well, evidently your butt. Okay. Chocolates. Can I have one? No. Oh. Could we talk first? What, what are, you? are you eating? I know what you're eating. Chocolate. Chocolat, mademoiselle. The food of the gods. Can I have Can a chocolate? Can I have a chocolat? Uh, no, they are all for me. Oh. What? Fine. How did you come down in the world? Revolution, driven from my home. Oh, that's good. But at least I saved my neck. Well, I think you left your chin behind. Oh, rude! Shots fired! Shots fired! Oh, I don't want it. Are you some kind of clown? Mais non, I am a French count. If you say so. Can I have a chocolat? And no, they are all for me. Oh, come on. Au revoir. Great. Habanera. Ladder to Mallory Cavendish. Empty stall. Can I go to there? Hmm. I can't see any clues. Hmm. We'll go in. I can't see any clues. I don't, I don't, oh. Because you can't see. Oh, fine. Hello, I'm Nelly. Is this a pirate I see before me? It is. Yes, what's your name? I am Laird Mallory Cavendish. I see. <laughs> what's a lad? Like a lord, but more drunk. <laughs> nice. How did you end up here? Oh, it's an old story. Mm -hmm. Drink, gambling, deep fried foodstuffs. That'll do it. But after all that's happened to me, I never forgot the Cavendish clan motto. Let me guess. What is this? What's what? <laughs> okay. Bye. Ah, uh, you're away. Uh -huh. Yeah, bye. Yeah, great. All right, let's talk to this guy and the other guy, and then we will Hola, end senorita. things here. Tell me about yourself. Tell me about yourself. You like this hat? It's fine. Sure. It's a gift from Sultan of Malaria. Uh, Sultan of Malaria. We play lacrosse together. I like your hat. I don't like your hat, so... So, anyway. You like my cigar? Um, Why? Did Captain Fancy Pants of Poshland give it to you? <laughs> no. Captain Fancy Pants and I, we do not speak. Of course not. So, how did you how end did you up? End you up a... like my shoe? What? what? It's custom-made lightweight tanned manatee hide. 
Sounds nice. Okay. Tell me about yourself. You like this hat? It's fine. It's a gift from Sultan yeah. of Malaria. We, okay, okay. We okay, play okay. lacrosse together. Goodbye, goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. Bye. Don't like your hat. Oh, deepest shame. Uh, hello? Oh, blackest night. I'm Nelly. I'm Nelly. Oh, confound this mortal clay. This weary heart. These tiny legs. He's got a case of the soliloquies. <laughs> ah, that's actually funny. Hark, my lord. What's this? A young pirate bride approacheth. Stop all that. What's up with you? I beg your pardon. <laughs> my athletic failures weigh heavy oh, upon me. Oh, yeah. I can understand that. Uh, hey, can you give hey, me a kiss? Hey, can you give me the king's shilling? I suppose I'm still technically an officer, but forgive an old tactician. What do you offer in exchange? Uh, I have a ribbon. I could write a rap song about you. Ooh, I could help you win a race. I could help you win a race? Well now, that's intriguing. With your help, I, I could rapped. begin an epic ah, training rapped. montage. Blood, sweat, tears, until I finally overcome my demons and win. Or we could cheat. Yes, let's do that. <laughs> I need to find ways to slow down the other toffs. To slow down the other toffs. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. We're going to end things here. We'll slow down the other toffs at another time. So let's see what we do here. So let's save. And we will call this uh, episode Uno. Episode one. Check. All right, cool. That is awesome. Thank you very much for uh, watching. I hope you liked the video. Let me, uh, extras. Rogues gallery. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, wait, no, I'm not good. No, don't stop. <laughs> okay, right up to the very end. <laughs> Uh, man, hey, if you uh, enjoyed watching the video, hit the like button if you would. Um, I really, really like the style of this game. It's a very cool point and click, and, and I like the uh, artwork and the background and, and just the overall feel for it. So uh, I'm going to be playing more of this. Um, whether or not I record it, I guess uh, let me know if, uh, if what you think. If you uh, want to see more of this or if you'd rather not i don't know i may put it out there anyway that's usually what i do um but uh, if you like the video hit the like button got any questions problems suggestions horror stories feel free to leave those in the comment section down below and uh thank you very much for watching we'll see you next time this is nelly kutalot well this i'm not i'm david and Ark. the game that's that's nelly kutalot well you know what i'm saying all right we'll, we'll see you next time